up? Welcome back to another market watch. And today we have some a set of some set of cards that uh you no know, jumped up in some price. Obviously, that's why you're here for the market watches to see which cards have jumped up in price or just tech cards in general that you might want to pick up. But um first we got Sun Goku Return of the Dragon Fist. Uh, solid nine dollar card right now. Uh, I think it's a good like boss monster for the new Zamasu deck coming out um, and uh, Realm of the Gods. Very very uh, great boss card that you can play within the deck. It's only a three drop technically uh, for the deck, and you're you know you're playing Aegis and all that, resting and drawing cards on your opponent's turn. Pretty pretty solid uh, card to uh, to pick up. I think to test out at least but yeah nine dollar card um i would say uh pick it up uh gogeta godspeed demolisher uh please tell me down below why this card has gone up in price because uh wait earlier today well not today but um the 11th uh january 11th uh last one was sold for four bucks there's a guy that bought six of these for five dollars each right as you can see, there's a buyout right there. The buyout was right there. Bought six of, of these for five dollars each. Now they're thirteen dollars lowest, and after the fourteen dollar ones, they become fifteen dollars ones. So this technically is between like a thirteen. Well, it's technically a yeah, fourteen dollar card right now. Uh, got Gogeta Godspeed Demolishers. Um, so it's like a it's like a weird version of the old. Um, the old uh, Gogeta so uh, it has double strike dual attack EX evolve for two blue over a blue Gogeta with energy cost of five once per turn if your leader card is mono blue when this card is played or your opponent activates a battle card skill choose up to two of your opponent's battle cards and return them to the hand and auto if your leader card is mono blue and you have six or fewer cards in hand at the end of your opponent's turn they choose three cards in their hand and places to the bottom of their deck in any order uh, I don't know why this card has jumped up in price. This card is really uh, vulnerable because this card does not have deflect or barrier. Um, I think this card would be okay if it at least had barrier, but it, does, it doesn't even have barrier, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, granted, you have a dual attack, 30 strike, um, a 30, 30 attack, double striker. So, uh, I don't know, but let me know down below why this card has gone up in price. Uh, Trunks Might, Born of Hope. Um, this car has gone up just a tad. Uh, the market price was two dollars, and this car is just now like a three or four dollar card right now. But uh, you're able to uh, cheat this out. I won't say cheat this out, but you're able to play it within the new trunks deck coming out, and uh, it might be like a good, nice tech card, like a boss, like a boss uh, tech card to try out within the deck. Granted, you're tapping four energy just to evolve this, so it might not even be that good. I just want to shed light on this card. Uh, you do have a double strike barrier dual tap blocker, but I think this card would have been even better if it was um, a deflect instead of barrier. But um, yeah, just shining some light on the card that you may, might want to play in the uh, the new Trunks deck, the yellow Trunks deck. Uh, Revenge Big Bang Attacks. Uh, let me refresh this. <laughs> let me refresh this. All right, so lowest, we have lowest price, $5 cards. This card was a five dollar card before, like two days ago. This card was a straight two dollar, a dollar fifty dollar card, a dollar fifty, a two dollar card. But now this card is double back in price to five dollars. Um, after this five, after this uh, six to uh, after the six uh, dollar card, then uh, after the shipping price. So after this like ten dollar card, this is easily a twenty dollar card, right back again. So. People are ramping up to play baby again. Okay, guys, don't be surprised when you see you sit down and the opponent across from you is playing baby because uh, revenge big bang attacks are going back up in price. And speaking of revenge big bang, you know you gotta play the baby golden avenger, um, sitting at the price of about seventeen, eighteen dollars right now. Uh, Everybody knows what this card does. Really, really solid blue card in general. If you sometimes you just play it for five, you uh, counter player counter counter for five, and you know you draw a card and and bottom deck any card ignoring barrier. 
and you have a 30 strike uh, attacker but um great great card for uh blue and like i said do not sleep on uh baby you know what i'm saying uh frieza army reborn just want to shed light on this secret rare this car is like a lightly played about 40 bucks right now so if you don't have this card and you want to pick up and you're like collecting all the secret rares i think now is a good time to pick up um this card because it's only 40 bucks for the uh, secret rare uh zeno almighty guardian uh last sold mm, excuse me last sold was um on the 26th of december for uh someone picked up three of them for 15 bucks and after that they haven't been selling at all so guys i would not say pick up this card at all uh wait until the price just dips down in price just a tad bit if you want to play this in the uh, great priest deck and um yeah basically it's just a, a counter attack and when you play it you just ko uh battle card um once you uh counter it but uh really really solid card just it's just technically just a one drop 15k also um yeah for the deck and it's a colorless for the deck also uh sun goku rival seekers uh they've gone up in price market price was about six to seven dollars now it's touching about it's touching about nine ten right now uh speaking of you know red blue support uh ultra instinct sun goku's energy explosions these this card has gone up in price my guy they were about what eight bucks like eight like they were they were around by eight nine bucks uh about a couple weeks ago but now they shot up in price to about 14 bucks uh close to 15 bucks for each copy of um energy explosion sun goku so uh let me now let me know down below man let me know if there's any spice for um invoker back into the meta you know what i'm saying um yeah so we have jaren unseen potentials uh this card has gone up in price also this card was about like five six bucks but now it's about a solid well, we have a lowest lowest for uh, ten dollars but after the ten dollar ones it's between 13 and 14 bucks for each copy of jaren um, I don't know if people are trying to play Jiren again. Um, I know it's really like a low to ground streamlined red deck, but I'm not too sure because a lot of people are like really hyped on, hyped on the new U7 Goku deck. So let me know down below uh, if people are still trying to play this deck, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Broly Crown of Retributions. Of course, we're going to talk about this card because you know the U universe seven deck but um yeah this car is eight dollars right now just for the original copies of um crown of retributions um after this you know there's only four sellers of this card of the original print and after that they are completely sold out um uh, but you do have the reprint version reprint versions are go going even higher for um for about like 10 bucks right now so you have a 10 dollar card for um uh, for the the reprinted alternate art versions let's see the the foil versions of this because this is not even foil let's see the foil version the foil versions oh baby 15 dollars for um foil broly crown of retributions so people are picking up this deck man this new goku deck is going to be something else um just want to shed light on bulma the bunny girl come on guys come on these are 15 16 dollars uh just for bunny girls you know what i'm saying uh i think it's just because it's just a waifu card people want to you know pick it up but other than that i see no other reason why this car has gone up in price yo market price yo this is a solid yo these are solid 16 dollars bro let me wait let me see the latest sales all right well yo see these are between like 15 and 30 dollars constantly you have sellers like buying these seat on Christmas day. Someone bought this for $32, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, this is solid between 15 and $30. I don't know why I can just say it's a, it's a waifu card. You know what I'm saying? Um, SS4 Vegeta peak of primitive power. This is the, um, the reprinted S, uh, SCR from mythic booster. They're touching about 18 bucks right now. Just wanted to shed light on the card. Um, also for Cell Zeno, they're um, the reprinted 
uh, SCR. It's about touching about 30 bucks right now. So if you always wanted to play a Cell Zeno, just need Cell Zeno within the deck, you have it right now for the low, low 30 bucks for um, 30 bucks for this card. And it's below market price also. So we have Oceanet, um, Oceanus Shinron, Negative Energy Explosion. They're touching about 23, 24 bucks. Um, I would say pick this card up because uh, this card is just, just snapped. It's really, really good. Um, See if, see if you can get it lower, like from a friend or so, if they're not using the card. But I'm pretty sure anybody that has this card is using this card. But um, yeah, 23 bucks for Oceanus. Um, Rosie Blast Manipulators. Finally, 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 you know, touching that $19, $20 mark. And uh, we only have five sellers here. So after the after this seller, well, this, after Pro Play Games, uh, sells these five. You know, um, yeah, after pro play games and um, they, you have the anger collections. After that, it's a touch about 25 bucks. And after 25, you're seeing $40 for Rosies. So um, if you have Rosies, go ahead and sell them if you can. But um, I mean, I got some myself, but you know, I'm a green player at heart. You know, I got to keep some for myself. And, uh, Majin Buu, Kibito, Kibito Kai Absorbs. They're touching about 61 bucks right now. Uh, if you need like a decent green um, SCR, go ahead and pick up a Majin Buu. Uh, this SCR, or if you can pick up the, um, let's see, the what's that Great Ape came out of Rising Unison Warrior. I think those, yeah, they're about to touch about 70 bucks too. Well, they're touching about 75 bucks. So 75 bucks for uh Grade eight mass stains uh, also, so you have you know cheap uh, choices for green SCRs um, at the moment. So Demon God Demigra True Power Unleashed. So this market price were four dollars, all right, four dollars. But now they shot up to 15, 16 bucks for uh, Demon God Demigra's uh, True Power Unleashed. Uh, granted, this card was reprinted in the um, special anniversary box. But uh, I think the, I think this card is getting hyped because of the new um, trunks, uh, trunks deck coming out. Let me see right here, alternate art ones. Yeah, see, alternate art ones are just a dollar fifty. Just a dollar fifty, you know what I'm saying? And uh, foil ones, three bucks. See, dollar fifty, three bucks, or you want to spend fifteen dollars on the original. Um, that's up to you. That's up to you uh, what type of artwork you like best. Uh, King Vegeta's Imposing Presence. They're touching about six, seven dollars right now. Um, it's a great card for uh, U7, U7 decks, Goji, uh, Goku. Um, SPR ones are touching about just a dollar more, about um, eight, nine bucks for, uh, pre for that. Uh, Beerus Fickle Gods, I will say that um, Try to pick this card up, you know, if you're if you're interested in the new Wii deck, because this is a new, this is a old Beerus, it's a two drop Beerus, uh, 15K, and you know, it's a check land, it's a, it's a card that has its energy exhaust uh, ignored, and they're only about two or three bucks each, you know what I'm saying, so I'm thinking about picking up some for myself, but um, cause I do, I do low key like the new Wii deck, I'm not gonna lie, I don't think I'm gonna try and uh, build that deck when it first comes out. Uh, Sun Gohan Ultimate Essences. We have about four or five bucks for these. Um, SPR versions are going for double the price for like about nine or 10 bucks. Um, I sold some earlier this month for, you know, for a decent price uh, to a seller. But um, yeah, 10 bucks for um, Gohans. And uh, Vegeta Resolve Renewed, really, really great counterplay for the uh, Goku deck. But you want to check out the, the foil ones because Lightly Plades are about, not what, $1. fifty, but the shipping is about it's about a $5 card. But after that, um, after that, the foil ones are about 7 bucks. But if you just want to go the normal route, the normal ones are about $0.50 cents each if you, don't, if you want non-foil versions of this card. Um, Quizakai's great, great time to pick this card up right now. Um, so you have the Mythic Booster version, um, SR, just four bucks, right? You have four dollars for this card. 
Then you have the original SR versions uh, going for it about 11, 12 bucks. And after the 12 bucks ones, they're about what, $15 for the original ones. But then you have the reprinted gold stamp ones just for $4 right here. So basically, um, now is the time to pick up Kawitsukai's. Trust me, guys, now is the time to pick up Kawitsukai's. Um, Mythic Booster officially comes out, I wanna say, like the actual box. I want to say like a couple weeks, maybe maybe a week, maybe, maybe it's this week. I might be it might be tripping. Um, I want to say next week, or yeah, it might be coming out this week. But um, I gotta check on the, on that. But um, yeah, Quizakai's. If you do not have them, pick them up right now. I I'll, I'll say I at least have two. Um, at least two. You know what I'm saying. But that is it for today's market watch. If you like what you see, give me a thumbs up. And uh, comment down below for uh, any other cars you want me to go over in the next market watch. And peace. I will see y'all next time.